if you have connected your computer, console, or any other devices to your Samsung Smart TV, but there's no HDMI signal, or it keeps disconnecting, then let me show you some troubleshoots that should fix these issues. First, we will begin by ensuring that we have the correct sources selected. It's easy to mix up if you have multiple devices connected to your Samsung Smart TV via the HDMI port. So let's open the menu and then go to connected devices. And from the list of sources, select the correct HDMI port. If this wasn't the reason, and even if you select the correct source, it says that HDMI cable is disconnected. Then we will check the display ports and the cables for damage and clean them properly. Furthermore, we can try using another cable or plug the cable into a different HDMI port. After that, your HDMI port should get a signal. If your issue still persists, then you can check the HDMI troubleshoot from the device care. So we will open the menu again and then go to all settings. Now go all the way down to support, then device care. It will check for your device, so let it finish. And after that, we will go to self-diagnosis. And from here, we will select HDMI troubleshooting. And if you have any incompatibility issues, such as resolution, it will fix it automatically for you. If the troubleshooter didn't fix your issue, then we will check for system updates, because sometimes outdated firmware can cause this issue. So we will go to all settings, and then support. From here, we will open software update and select update now. This will download any update if your system is outdated. And after that, we will go ahead and cold boot our TV. We will do that by disconnecting it from power along with all the devices and let it sit for a few minutes. Then plug them in again and turn on your TV. And after that, you should have no problem with HDMI signal. But if none of these steps helped in your case, it may be an internal hardware issue. So it's recommended that you contact Samsung support for further help. I hope you found this helpful. If you have any questions, leave them down below and I'll get back to you shortly.